Okay, welcome back. In this video, I'm going to make another top synth to uh, act more like a lead. Um, however, we're still going to be using the same MIDI, uh, so it's all building upon that same rhythm and that same uh, melody that we've got. So I'm going to, once again, go into Anna, like so. Just close that again for a second. Um, these have all got the same side chain. Oh no, the sub was slightly different. So we're going to use the same side chain settings. Again, these can all be tweaked now, maybe a little bit later on when I'm doing some mixing, but this is just to get us going with the track. Okay. And we're going to use, make sure this is the right one. Okay. The same MIDI. Now let's. Okay, so I'm going to want a bit of a, a lead, obviously that's sitting higher in the frequencies and just something, you know, to, to make it a little more epic, make it uh, a bit bigger. Again, this is going to be probably used in the arrangement coming in as like a, as like a new section or a new sound for the B sections of the drops. Uh, so let's get going. We'll uh, have a play around and see what we can come up with. Okay, so I'm liking the sound of that so far, uh, but quite often you can find some very cool noises in the oscillator 4 and 5 section here. Um, so we'll see what we can get out of this one. Make sure you turn on um, key track here so it actually plays in key. Quite like that, added in with the uh, the buzz square. Again, this is going to be sitting on the very top, and to help the whole sound kind of blend in with the mix uh, and sound a bit bigger, we'll add some some reverb here. So you can see how uh, much of a difference the reverb makes. So this is working really well. Um, I'm just going to come in here and just chop out all the lows as much as I can without really affecting the sound. So that's too much. Something like that. Uh, and yeah, that's really it. It fits nicely because um, 
you've got to make sure you've got it nice and wide. So as long as you've got more than one voice, you can really uh, detune it and push up the width here and it really spreads it wide in the speakers, which is what we want here because so far these ones are all pretty much straight down the middle. We can play with them maybe a bit later on, but uh, this one really helps. So this will be very useful come the drops when we need to uh, change it up and add some more excitement. So uh, that's all for this one and uh, we will um, we'll come back with another video when we add some more to it.